Now, reset your game progress, do the proper upgrades, come again, 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 again. Unfortunately, you're going to need to play this endlessly, endlessly. Come over here, hit level up, put next mile, do the upgrades, then go to the next hero, do that, and just leave your phone up. Welcome to Idle Games TV, and we're going to Idle Hero TD. Definitely a tower defense candidate. So you're going to have heroes and you're going to need to kill a lot, lot of monsters. You're going to have different kind of bosses that you need to kill. And you're going to collect a lot, a lot of gold coins that you're going to use to level up your heroes. You guessed it, right? Now, you're going to have energy and you're going to have gemstones and a lot, a lot of skills that you can choose from in order for you to have different kind of possibilities. Now, eventually you are going to get stuck and what you're going to need to do, you're going to need to prestige or here you're going to need to reset the game progress in order for you to be able to get some points that you're going to use in order for you to do more and more upgrades to do some power-ups over here in order for you to become more stronger, get more gold coins to do more upgrades and so on. You're going to be able to use the power-ups with prestige points, you're going to be able to do different kind of researches with the energy that you're going to get and also buy and upgrade different kind of spells with the energy. You're going to have some scrolls eventually and you're going to have different kind of tournaments but you need to pass wave 500. I'm almost there, almost there but decided to show you this game because it's really very really nice. So keep in mind you're going to unlock different kind of heroes. At first you're going to start with the common ones, after that you're going to have these uncommon ones and eventually you're going to have the rare ones as well and if you're going to pass wave 500 you are going to be able to get the epic ones which are really really important okay so keep that in mind now one one important thing is the fact that you're going to need to reset the game progress a lot and when i mean a lot you're going to need to leave the phone on in order for you to be able to upgrade over here these guys you know these heroes are not these guys because probably some of them are ladies also okay, who knows and if you're going to upgrade them you're going to get stronger. If not, you're going to die like here. Now, if you're going to notice that you're going to die quite, quite a lot, you're going to go in prestige. If you're going to hit prestige, as I mentioned, you're going to get a lot, a lot of points. By getting these points, you're going to come over here and you're going to be able to place the heroes that you already bought. You can have three similar heroes, okay, which is really important. Now, I have already saved a uh, let's say a uh, position over here, a preset position. I'm just going to load it, hit play, and the heroes will automatically do their thing. Now, very important, you're going to have also some bosses over here. Now, if you're going to kill the bosses, you're going to get different kind of resources. You're going to have different kind of spells, as I mentioned. The spells are very really important. If you're going to go over here, you're going to notice that some of the spells will offer you more gold coins, or some of them will offer you more energy, like for example this one over here. All enemies killed reward you with plus 4 energy for 17 seconds. Now this is a skill that will reset every 360 seconds, okay? It's really important to have it on auto mode. You're going to have the possibility to put skills on auto cast or just cast them when you have the bosses. You're just going to need to click on them, you're going to see that they have manual meaning that you're going to actually need to click on the skill you're going to have bosses meaning that they're going to cast the skills only when they see the boss or you're going to have auto cast meaning that they're going to cast that skill automatically when the cooldown is over now you're going to have different kind of events every once in a while that will double up different kind of things more rank experience if you're going to have enough rank experience you're going to be able to upgrade over here the battle pass and by upgrading this you're going to get different kind of free free things that are really important and you're going to use them now, besides the bosses that I just mentioned over here, some of them will offer you gold coins, some of them will offer you energy, some of them will offer you experience for the heroes. Every hero over here has the possibility to be ranked up. If you're going to have enough uh, AP points, let's say ability points, uh, you're going to be able to increase different kind of things, like for example the range, the critical, the attack, and uh, other things that are suitable for every hero, so all of them have kind of the same idea. Uh, what I would suggest is try to update the damage, definitely that's going to be important. And the last one over here, which is the uh, rank experience, because he will get more experience every time that uh, it will kill an enemy. Now, try to mingle between the heroes in order for you to put them over here in this front position, uh, because that's going to be the hero that will get the most amount of experience if you're going to reset your game progress, and that's going to be really important. So put different kind of other heroes in order for them to be leveled up in order for you to use those ability points for them as well. 
Now, besides the bosses, we're going to have different kind of uh, missions over here, achievements, daily tasks, and different kind of challenges. If you're going to complete them, you're going to get different kind of resources. Most likely, you will get more and more gemstones. With the gemstones, you can also do some upgrades over here, which are really, really important. You're going to I notice that these ones are really good but also what you're going to want to upgrade over here is going to be the game speed that's going to offer you the possibility to play faster and more daily so try to focus on getting 2500 gemstones in order for you to increase the game speed which i think is the most important thing that you can buy with the gemstones at least now besides that in order for you to prestige you're going to need those prestige power points but we are going to consume them over here Try to upgrade the damage as much as you can, try to upgrade the range, critical chance definitely is going to be good, but also you're going to need to have more gold coins in order for you to be able to do more upgrades. So keep that in mind, okay, that's going to be really, really important. Now I'm going to go for the damage over here because I do need 5000% more because I'm noticing that my uh, base is getting destroyed. So what I will need to do, I will need to increase the damage over here. That's going to be my main focus, to have as much damage as I can for those enemies that I have at wave 460 or whatsoever. Now, reset your game progress, do the proper upgrades, come again, 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 again. Unfortunately, you're going to need to play this endlessly, endlessly. Come over here, hit level up, put next mile, do the upgrades. Then go to the next hero, do that and just leave your phone on. Unfortunately, you need to leave your phone on in order for you to be able to do some progress over here. The good part is that you're still going to get some idle rewards out of this game if you're going to go offline, which is decent enough, okay? Now, you're going to have even some ads in order for you to get some buffs in the next two minutes, which are really, really important. So do this, watch these ads in order for you to get more and more boosts, more and more bonuses. But also from here, if you're going to watch five ads so with every five ads that you're going to watch sorry you are going to be able to get plus 10 percent for the damage so for every five ads that you're going to watch plus 10 percent plus 10 percent plus 10 percent to the current damage boost really important watch these ads now guys if you have played a better game regardless if it's a tower defense kind of game but let's hope that it's idle drop them in the comments below until next time take care be safe and don't forget to subscribe bye